The DePinto family has been making tomato sauce every August for generations. Twelve crates of tomatoes were purchased this year. Only plum tomatoes are used because they have less seeds and are meatier. The tomatoes are first poured into a large bucket. They must be washed and inspected carefully. Laura and Paul begin the task of washing hundreds of plum tomatoes. Mrs. DePinto separates the damaged tomatoes and removes the imperfect sections. After washing, the excess water is put to use in the garden. Nothing goes to waste. <laughs> Two propane gas tanks are used to boil water. The tomatoes are placed in large buckets and boiled for 30 minutes. Boiling softens them up and loosens the skin and seeds for the tomato press. Gino empties the boiled tomatoes into the tomato press that separates the pulp, seeds, and sauce. The pulp is run through the machine three times to extract every last drop of sauce. Amanda and Isabella wash the next batch of tomatoes. The entire DePinto family gets involved. Dominic and Michael continue the washing of the tomatoes. Now it's Isabella and Michael's turn. More tomatoes will be boiled. Mr. DePinto and the family have been working for five hours. Paul carries out crate number nine. This is the basil. The basil is already washed, ready to go in the jar. Kim takes the basil, freshly picked from the garden, and adds it to each jar for flavor. Between 250 and 300 sterilized jars are ready. Paul carefully fills each jar with just the right amount of sauce. Amanda guides the pulp through the strainer.
Corrado and Isabella wash their last batch of plum tomatoes. Lucia is filling the last jars with sauce. The covers must be boiled and sterilized. Angela places a lid on each jar. The filled jars are placed in a giant vat. They are covered with a sheet to prevent any clashing of jars. They will be boiled for 30 minutes. Afterwards, the jars will be placed on a large sheet to cool overnight. As the sterilized jars cool, the contents contract, forming a perfect vacuum seal. Focaccia is served to celebrate a job well done. The De Pinto family worked together for nine hours, but will enjoy their labor all year long. <laughs>